Gerda Wegener, is best known today, for her feminist and lesbian-themed art. She was also married to Einar Wegener, who was the first known transgender female artist, after he had surgery to change his gender. David Habershoff's 2000 book The Danish Girl, and the 2015 movie with the same name, were both based on their marriage. Wegener was born Gerda Marie Frederick Gottlieb, in the village of Hamaleu, Denmark in 1886. She went to the Royal Danish Academy of Fine Arts, when she was a teen. There, she met fellow artist Einar Wegener. When she was 19 and he was 22, they got married. She worked as an illustrator for Vogue, and other fashion magazines, after she graduated from art school. Wegener's art often showed beautiful, wealthy women wearing expensive clothes, and enjoying their wealth. Einer dressed up as a woman, and posed for Wegener, when one of her female models, had to back out at the last minute. He found that he liked dressing up as a woman, so he changed his name to Lily and became one of her favorite models. In 1912, the couple moved from Copenhagen, which was very conservative, to Paris, where Einer started living openly as Lily Elba. Wegener began to take risks with her own art as well, making pictures of beautiful women that were sexually explicit. In the 1930s, Lily Elba was one of the first people who was known to have had sex reassignment surgery. When word got out about the surgery, the King of Denmark broke up Gerda and Lily's marriage. They stayed close until Elba died suddenly, during her fourth and last surgery in 1931. Gerda Wegener did win a few awards during her life, such as first place in a 1908 competition, about the feminine ideal, and two gold medals at the 1925 World Fair in Paris. However, by the time she died in 1940, most people didn't like her work, as much as they used to. Like the work of many female artists who didn't live in the middle class, her work didn't get the praise it deserved, until many years after she died. In 2016, the Arken Museum of Modern Art in Copenhagen, held the largest show of Wegner's work to date to honor her.